we have a mayor who followed through on his promise. And we had the largest, single largest uh, expansion of pre-K in the history of the United States happened this year in New York City. And what I would like to do now is to not only cement those gains, but to amplify those gains by putting forth a proposal that says we want to limit the class sizes of New York City between kindergarten and third grade to 15. We want to start by first phasing in, targeting the neediest areas of the city, which coincidentally happen to be the areas where we actually have more space in our buildings. We want a seismic shift in our school system. We know that if a child is on grade level reading by the end of third grade, they have a much higher percentage of success in terms of graduating from high school. We're saying to people also at the same time, good policy, fiscal policy, we are more than happy to give favorable tax treatment to people in our city, but we think you should be a resident if you're receiving that favorable treatment. I want to be clear, we are not advocating for a new tax. What we are saying is that people who receive favorable tax treatment uh, either through the assessment process or through different programs where tax breaks are given shall continue to receive them as long as they are a resident paying taxes to the city of New York. We're talking about co-ops and condominiums. We're talking about different uh, perks that they're received through the assessment process on their property value, perks through different programs. We're talking about you can have all of that as long as you live here. If you want favorable tax treatment from the city of New York, you need to pay taxes to the city of New York. If you want to be an absentee landlord, you understand that you're not getting that favorable tax treatment. It's completely your choice. This is something that will actually help children. And if people really are, want to use politics to help education, this is concrete. This will do it. So to me, what I'm saying to the people in Albany, and I will be working with the legislatures, with the legislature, I will be lobbying on behalf of this. If you really want to work on a policy that's going to help children, this is it.